I feel the hype already. <clears throat> Excuse me. Man, <laughs> today is the anniversary of Sonic Adventure 2. Of course, I only have Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, but it still counts. June 19th, 2001. Sonic Adventure 2. Select. Now, <laughs> funny story, I did not do all this, because doing it a third time, since I did it twice on GameCube, <laughs> honestly, I would have only done it once, because that, it was a lot the first time, but my brother ended up deleting my save file, <laughs> and he was like two or three at the time, it's fine. <laughs> but I, I did twice as much as I wanted to. That included the chow and the cart races. Anyway, I'm going to run through a few of my favorite levels. Like, at least one from each gameplay style. I might have a few hot takes, too. Because this is not one of my favorites. And honestly, I think Eggman's levels are actually really good. Uh, what do we start with? <laughs> First hot take, I think I want to start with either Death Chamber or Aquatic Mine. Because I loved Aquatic Mine. Yeah, I think... I think Aquatic Mine would be a better... Um... Better start. Hang on. Something feels weird. Is the audio off for you? Because right now it feels like the ring audio... I, I don't know. Hmm. Man, the music. Am I just extremely lucky? Because I'm close. I mean, it's closer. Ah, perfect. Uh, wow, another one already. I love this level. A giant maze. Very claustrophobic. That's going to help my rank. Hmm, it's not here. I wonder if it's downwards. I haven't played this game in my... A year or more <laughs> and my prime was when I was in like sixth grade maybe fifth something like that I, I think it's time to change the water level you know I didn't really pay attention to Knuckles music much but it's really nice I appreciate the more the more chill tone Sonic can have his high energy. I always thought of Knuckles as more of a calm, stoic kind of guy. Basically, what they want to portray Shadow as, except now they seem to be portraying Shadow as just this rage-filled guy. Don't like that very much. But Knuckles, I think his best characterization was in Sonic Adventure 1. Yeah, I'm I'm lost. I think you can tell. Well, not lost, but like, I'm not sure where exactly to go from here. Definitely not here. Hmm. <laughs> so this video was kind of impromptu because I just found out that the, that it's the anniversary of Sonic Adventure 2. Yeah, it's got to be behind a wall somewhere. So... I'm... I'm gonna take a hint. Aw, oh, man. Bad hint. Okay, time for water level 3. I have so many memories of this game. Mostly playing multiplayer with my siblings. So many hours doing that. 
I love it so much. Huh, do I have a Mystic Melody? I must have it. No, not you. Definitely not getting an A rank. That's okay, I shouldn't expect to get an A rank after like years of not practicing. Or a year. I don't know. Oops. Because even when I did practice... Hmm. Even when I did practice, it wasn't very long. Okay, one more hit. There are so many ma narrow paths with tracks. Come on. I think the hint system is mostly okay, but I miss the this way ball. <laughs> That's what I used to call it when I was a kid. I mean, I knew it was to call, but the this way ball is just funnier. Hmm. Man, okay, so this is how you control Knuckles. The gliding is so perfect, so precise. Frontiers, take some lessons. Also a dream team, apparently. What's going on? I... Is it in here? Oh, wow. Wow, okay. Next. Maybe I should have picked Death Chamber. I feel like I'd get around that place better. Man, I, I couldn't decide between this and Death Chamber as a kid for the best Knuckles level. And I know, it's kind of funny choosing the most closed up, uh, narrow, I'm trying to find the right word. The most claustrophobic levels, but that's kind of what gives them their charm. Also, does anyone else think it's really weird how they had random ghosts just throughout this game? Random ghosts everywhere? I wonder if it's just... Wow. I wonder if it's just in the spooky levels, because I... I'm pretty sure they were in space too for some reason. Ooh. Yeah, I feel good. Me too, Knuckles. <laughs> Stage Next. Uh, we'll go with an Eggman level. Well, I don't know. Maybe not Cosmic Wall, but definitely not a Tails level. Definitely not. Mmm. Oh no, not Sand Ocean. I'm looking for Lost Colony. I guess that would be in space. Come on. There we go. Lost Colony. If something's wrong with the audio, well, at least you get the music. <laughs> Ooh, speaking of the music. Wow, you hear this? That bass? This really feels like an infiltration. They nailed Eggman's levels. I wonder if I can A rank this. I mean, I hope I can. Uh, something's telling me to go on this one. Because I know there's at least one platform that sinks into the, the green stuff, the acid, whatever it is. Man. It's moody in here. Love it. Okay, 
Now we go back this way. Hang on. Hop up here. And we're supposed to find a switch. What a level. Aw, oh, man. That was not supposed to happen, of course. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Can I live? I'm not getting that A rank. <laughs> That's okay. I'm just here to celebrate the game. Yosh. I wonder why he says that. Is that like a leftover from the Japanese uh, sub? Because it, it's kind of weird. It does sound like Dean Bristow. Man, I miss Dean Bristow. Mike Pollock? He does fine. It just really depends on the media. Like... Some games he's fine. Other games, it's kind of weird. No, no. <sighs> Just before the checkpoint. That's alright. Actually, why am I doing this when I'm not going to get an A rank? I can just blast away. You see what I'm doing, right? Trying to um, target as many as many targets as I can before shooting. Yeah, that's how you get an A rank, but I shouldn't be because I die twice. And I keep losing my rings. Definitely should be more cautious with how I play. Especially being out of practice like this. Honestly, I really would have wanted to, to A rank this. I know I keep talking about the ranks, but man, I have it. I, I know what to do. <laughs> it all comes down to execution. Just like with my speed runs, you just have to do it right. Even if you know how to do it, it's like, I guess, the difference between... Hmm... How to say it? Well, well, being a good teacher and being a good doer of something. And I have a perfect example, I just don't remember what it is. <laughs> Someone with natural talent and... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Monsters, Inc., maybe? I know, a random example to pull out of nowhere, but... Mike and Sully. Yeah, that seems right. Their dynamic is kind of like that. Sully has the natural talent. Mike has the know-how, the technique. That, that's the perfect example. Example for what? I don't remember anymore. <laughs> that's okay. This really feel oh, big the cat. I didn't shoot him. Ah oh, man. Well, let's leave this room. Yosh. He says something like that with the chow too. I just listened to a retrospective of, so of Sonic Adventure two. Oh. A retrospective of some... I'm just gonna go. <laughs> I'm just gonna go back. <laughs> anyway... Uh, what I heard is that... There was only a team of like... 20 people working on this? Yeah, that's crazy. 20 people. Sega is such a messy company. Please, at least be a C. 
<laughs> I died twice or, or three times. It wasn't good. Wow. That wasn't so difficult. Okay. Stage select. Now for a speed stage. I guess the moment you've all been waiting for. Now this one is really hard to choose, which is why I went with the others first. Um, I used to love Green Forest, and I'm not really hyped about City Escape like most people are. Like, it's a good opening set piece. Ooh, Pyramid Cave. I know someone who doesn't like this. <laughs> but, you know, it just feels right. Going deep in this cave. Aw oh, man, missed it. Going deep in this cave to search for a... Wait, this is after he gets to the entrance of the base, isn't it? Something like that. So here we are. Just listen to that. It's, it's like normal sonic rock, but it's also kind of chill. Ah, Yeah, definitely rusty. This is not working. <laughs> what, what would your favorite stages be? I feel like I should have done Cosmic Wall because I really like that one. You know, I might as well go all the way and do a Rouge stage, a Tail stage, and a... Shadow stage. <laughs> I literally forgot Shadow's name. This commentary stuff is hard. <laughs> it's okay. We're having a good time. Well, I hope you. I hope you're having a good time. Just celebrating Sonic Adventure 2. Nice. Wait a minute, I just thought of something. This is an Eggman base. Why does he have ghosts? I wonder if it's because it's just repurposed. Ugh, another Big the Cat. Couldn't homing attack him or anything. Missing features. Nope, nope, not that. Did you know you can cancel when your homing attack goes crazy like that? Yes, yeah, Sonic, get the... <laughs> you know what he's going to say. Onwards. You know, I think... Tails' music for Hidden Bass kind of fits the area better. I don't know why. I haven't listened to it in a while, but... Something about it just feels more... Oh boy. Missed it. Definitely not A-ranking this one. Hopefully a C. Yeah, no. Don't, don't do that. I have never had that happen. Literally never. That's... That's... <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Okay, Sega. You know, they ported this game and reported this game. Same with Sonic Adventure 2. And I think stuff just gets broken along the way. So, if they're gonna remake stuff, it has to actually get fixed and polished for the actual platform they're working on. But, for what it is, it's mostly still playable. I'm still on the fence about doing the other three characters. Cause, ah. Oh. Yeah, okay, this doesn't feel like the GameCube. Something's up. Either that or it's just my lack of practice. Could be both. 
That was cool. Uh, Sonic Adventure 2 has a lot of that was cool moments, which is good. But I, I don't know. It, it feels a little samey. Maybe I just played it way too much as a kid. I probably did. Ah. <laughs> uh. Yeah. Oh. Oh, wow. No is right. I messed up. I was not expecting to mess up. <laughs> Well, mistakes happen. The presentation is so good. There we go. I just love this area. Sonic is just doing his thing in this spooky, deep, dark place. And we have found the base. Way to signpost it, Eggman. <laughs> you know, I might as well do the bio-lizard. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay. I I think I'll do one more level just to get the A rank. Final Rush and not Final Chase, because I really don't like Final Chase. Actually, no. Crazy Gadget. I like Crazy Gadget. You know what? <laughs> I was going to do this to... No, no. To do an, another attempt at an A rank, but I this level is so unconventional that I don't think I can get an A rank on the first try. That's okay, I just like this place. The music. Ah, nope, nope, nope. Yep, out of practice. I used to speedrun this game. Not the whole game, just the levels I liked. As always. <laughs> I, I would never speedrun an, an entire game. Just, I can't do that. <laughs> the sheer amount of focus and the duration, ugh, no. No way. But, speedrunning individual levels is fine. Okay, I'm going to do something terrible. Can I still do this? Maybe. I did it! Haha! <laughs> yes, yes, I still got it. <laughs> uh, the timing for me to say that. Okay, okay. Okay, guys. Ready? Oh, yeah, speaking of that, I heard that... Okay, that wasn't nice. I heard that at one of the Sonic Symphonies, there was a fan who said, Here we... And then the rest of the, the the audience joined in with the go. And that's just really cool and wholesome. I think I'll get a B at least. But yeah. Sonic fans are great. There's just... <laughs> just like the franchise itself, there's so much diversity that... You have the great ones, you have the awful ones, you have the weird ones. There's... there's some of everything. 
whether you like it or not. <laughs> that's just how it, oh man, that's just how it is. I like to think I'm one of the more likable fans, at least. Or less annoying, because I know I have some some really hot takes. But we're all here for the bluebird. We all just want to see the games do well. We want to see Sega do better. Please, Sega, do better. <laughs> Man, this is such a cool level. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Just look at that. That's my Sonic. Come on. Come on, man. The next area should be the last, right? No, not yet. Ah. Uh, I'm really not doing well. Better than I expected, but possibly not well enough for an A rank. I wish the gravity switching was seamless, like in Spark 2. That was super cool. I wonder how that was programmed. Because you just go and you reorient yourself. It's, it's smooth, you don't lose the flow or your place in the level or anything. And I'd say that's one of the more SA2 inspired levels in the first place. Just the way it's laid out, the overall aesthetic. I keep trying to use left trigger to bounce. <laughs> it's my Sonic GT mind. No, not GT, Sonic Omens. Yeah, it's Omens that did that. GT had it on the B button? Circle for PlayStation. Yeah, I think that's how it was. And then Rascal has two inputs for their bounds. That's... It's something to get used to. Almost done. Man, I haven't even talked about the story of this game. The story is... Messy. <laughs> I think... As a kid, I liked the hero story better, but now I like the dark story better. It felt a little bit more cohesive, because of course it fills in the holes that the hero story left. Almost there. So when you replay the hero story, it's like, what is this? Because <laughs> you're literally not given the info. And there we go. Yes. Please be an A. Man, six minutes is long. Probably a B. Oh. That was cool. Yes, it was. I've done this. I've done this level way better before. Wow. What a good way to end. What a nice note to end on. Yeah. That's. Man, I want to keep going. <laughs> let's let's do the bio lizard. Where can I? Story select. Scene select. There we go. Bio lizard. Ah, this seems to be unskippable. And there we go. I remember watching videos of this back when back when the game first released. I thought Shadow was the coolest thing ever. He was until they made him too cool. 
Now he just overshadows Sonic. They don't balance each other out, and I think that's not good. You hear that? That's the roar of a real monster. Unlike that Shadow Generations trailer. Come on, come after me. I wish he was faster, honestly. Also, I love how Shadow skates. I, <laughs> I've i talked about this multiple times. Aw oh, man, I wanted to do that perfectly. Yeah, Sh Shadow's a skater, not a flyer. There we go. Let's see if I can do this in one try. Honestly, I want to do King Boom Boo too. <laughs> this celebration of Sonic Adventure 2 is going on quite a while. This is kind of random, but I think Sonic's moveset was at its best in Sonic Heroes. Dare I say. Because... <laughs> hang on. Because of course you have your homing attack, but you also have blue tornado, and you can use that with a little bit of movement tech to bounce extra high. Not bounce, but jump extra high. You have the wall jump, you have rocket excel with its own wind properties, and of course the level up system. What else? I'm probably missing stuff. But yeah, if, if Sega could just hone in on... Oh man. Hone in on that style of gameplay. That would uh, that would be so cool. Oh man, this reminds me. I was watching a Sendo DX video, I think yesterday. <laughs> it, it's his Sky Rail video. I strongly recommend checking that out. Because it was so funny. Partially because he really believes that poor Shadow had a bounce. And you know, that is a missed opportunity, because Shadow d Well, I guess that's one thing they do to differentiate Sonic and Shadow. Only Sonic ever has the bounce, except in fan games, but Shadow... Mm, I don't think it's enough. I really don't think it's enough. Because... I don't know, what are they supposed to do with Sonic, huh? I'd be alright if they if they made Sonic I'm really messing up while trying to think about this. <laughs> okay, so my problem is that Sonic and Shadow are not balanced. Shadow is just flat out better. And Sonic is supposed to be the fastest thing alive. But Shadow can stop time. What good is speed if time is stopped, you know? Nothing. It's it's nothing. Last hit. So they need to do something besides just give Sonic the bounce. No, no, no. He need... really? Okay, this may be buggier than the GameCube version. But yeah, Sonic needs more than a bounce. Just maybe he's naturally slightly faster than Shadow? That would be nice. I might as well throw in a cutscene for good measure. It's THE cutscene. The servers are the seven chaos. Chaos, chaos is power. power. Power is enriched by the heart. The controller is the one that unifies the chaos. Only you can do this. Stop the Chaos Emeralds! You know what? This is the answer to Knuckles going on adventures. He needs to take the Emerald with him. I mean... He can... I, I just thought of this on the fly. He can use some of the Master Emerald's power to keep the island afloat and go on adventures for a while before the power Chaos runs out. Is... It's... 
I don't want to say it's genius, but I think it's a good idea. The echo was a little too much. Sonic. Here we go. Such an ugly view of Shadow. Seriously. Man, Knuckles was more tan. Here we go. Main theme, the Seven Chaos, the two hedgehogs. Shadow should have stayed dead. Not because I don't like him, but because it would have had more emotional weight. Because he was asleep for, for 50 years, then he goes super and can't sustain the form so he falls to earth. So, why does he survive in his base form? Now, I don't like this fight. <laughs> sure, it's hype, but mechanically, no. But I'm here, so I might as well finish it off. Here we go. I, I feel like I just said that three times. But yeah. I like Super Shadow's color. Also, this... I think this is the last game where Super Sonic actually looked right. Like, his spikes angled the right way. Oh, foreshadowing. Shadow, are you okay? I wonder what the bio lizard was before all this. I mean, I know he's a salamander, but was he like... I don't know, was he an anthropomorphic salamander? Oh boy. These lasers. Okay. No, 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 no. Okay, um, it's Sonic's turn. In case you didn't know, it's up to you, Sonic. you can switch. Oh, oh no. Oh no. That's actually bad. The ring count. Honestly, I think it's a pretty cool balance that Sonic and Shadow keep getting rings for each other. Or for themselves, at least. Taking turns like that. Cool idea. Now... Oh yeah, another hot take. This is Amy's best voice. I think her name is Lisa something? That was close. But yeah. Amy's best voice, Knuckles' best voice. Sonic's best was Jason Griffith to me. Because of the emotional impact of his games. Oh, I've never gotten this dialogue. That's actually bad. No, the dialogue is good, but like, the situation is actually bad. Oh no, 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 no. I'm cutting it close. Too close. Can I do this? Nope. Nope, I'm gonna die. I'm switching. Man. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Man, I like how this changes. You get into the atmosphere, and everything starts going red. 
So cool. Sometimes hype can carry a, a fight. Sometimes. Ooh, I love that background. Screenshot. I might as well let this play too. I'm here, so <laughs> we're gonna be here to the end. Oh yeah, why couldn't Sonic Chaos control the end away? They can't just retcon Sonic's Chaos Control. I mean, I guess they can and did. That's that. Maria, this is what you wanted, right? This is my promise I made to you. Okay, hearing that now kind of hits hard because I made a promise to a close friend. And I don't think I've been keeping it well enough. And I'm trying. It's going to be a lifelong promise. Not like marriage or anything. That's <laughs> No, it's like... It's a basic, I'll be there for you, but sometimes I get overwhelmed with my own stuff and I lose my super form and can't support my friend. Man, that was cheesy. But yeah, just to be real for a second. <sighs> Goodbye, Shadow. I mean... Shadow, Sayonara, Shadow the Hedgehog. All those who live here on Earth. He was what he was, a brave and heroic hedgehog. He gave his life to save his planet. Shadow back to that, back to that retrospective I saw. It gave a lot of insight to the story that I didn't have as a kid. As a child, Gerald wasn't just a maniac, but he also wasn't right to do what he did. Of course, that part I knew. Oh, the best line in the game is coming. I don't know, but what I do know is we all did it together. Yep, roll credits, end game. Thanks for watching. Take care of yourselves. Ugly!